Hey guys, Glummery, Glummery Online. How are you? It is Friday, November 29th. Hope you're having a great weekend. For you, you guys in the States, I know it's some sort of holiday down there for you guys. Or some sort of crazy shopping day. Uh, today's lesson is starting a blog in 2020 and actually making money. This is tips for beginners. This is really cool because what I'm going to do is I'm going to get you, I'm going to show you exactly how to set up a blog because you're going to need a blog. And no matter which way you're going to go with your online business, you're going to need a blog because you're going to use this blog in different ways depending on what business you have online. But you're going to use this blog. And what you want to do is this is ba this is kind of your baby. This is your garden. You want to grow this blog so that it gets to some authority and people are going to find it. So there's going to this is going to be your garden that you're going to always be sort of working on. And you're going to be adding to it and adding to it and adding to it. And no matter what direction you go, you're going to keep adding to this because you're going to be able to use it as a pointer or a place to draw people or whatever it is. So if you like videos on how to make money online, make sure you subscribe and we're going to jump into it. So why do you need a blog? It's like there's all these tools out there. You don't need a blog. Yeah, you do. Well, I, I'm in a network marketing company. They give me uh, they give me a whole done for you done for me suite. It's like, yeah, that's great. What if you leave that company? What if that company goes belly up? All that work that you put into that suite is gone, right? Oh, they give me landing pages. Yeah, they look exactly like everyone else. Why do they want to join you with your with that landing page when they're all the same, right? So how do you make yourself different? And also, there's no way to control a lot of those landing pages. Yeah, they they put your leads or your your downline into a back office. But you can't get that back office out and into your own autoresponder. And sometimes when you do, if you download a, a spreadsheet of it, you either have to manually uh, enter them into an, a proper autoresponder that you own or upload it. And sometimes autoresponders go, no, because you bought a list, right? So it's better. It really is truly better to put them into your list to begin with. Now, if you're just getting started, you don't have to do that. I recommend it. And stick around to the end because I'm going to show you a way to 10x your business and it's going to make it a lot easier um, basically right from the get-go. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do, you're going to, get, you're going to need hosting. So I'm going to show you uh, the hosting that I use. It's called A2 and it comes with, I believe they, stay, they give you a free domain with it, right? So you, you, buy, you, you buy the package. I recommend... Now you can't, I think they might even have, be having a Black Friday sale, maybe. If not, it, it's incredibly inexpensive. Right here, you want the Swift. Why do you want Swift? Because it comes with unlimited websites and it comes with free SSL. And you want your website to have SSL on it because Google only will rank uh, uh, websites that have a secured uh, certificate. So you want to make sure that you have SSL. Uh, eight, eight, they're super fast, super, super great uh, hosting package here. And like I said, this is free. You can get unlimited websites. Um, let's see, does it, does it come with free domain? Uh, I think it still has free domain. It used to anyways. If not, you can go pick up a domain anywhere. You can go to uh, Namecheap or I'll put a domain place in there. But I'm, I thought that they, they keep with a free website or a free domain. Anyways, um... Uh, Get full details. Let's see. If not, I will put a link to where I buy my domain names because I, I do buy other domain names. Uh, let's see. Websites, unlimited, unlimited, hassle free, uh, money back guarantee, migrate your site, A2 optimize, all state drive, some new hardware, it has all the stuff, web staging. Phone support, yeah, you get everything. It's like it's the best deal by far. Um, let's go. Oh, oh, park domain at websites, unlimited subdomains, park domains. Yeah, unlimited, 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 unlimited. Okay, so I guess they're maybe they're not offering a domain anymore. No big deal. You'll jump over to the other link I put below and grab one from uh, Namecheap. Or, I mean, you can grab them here. I think they, they, they sell them here as well. So you can grab one, grab one there. So that's the first thing you're going to do. You're going you're gonna to go and you're going to basically get Swift. When you get into the back office, what you want to do is you want to just click one click Word, WordPress install and boom, it installs WordPress. And then you're going to go get this tool. It's called CB Automator. And you want to uh, click the link below, install this. This is brilliant. 
And what it will do, it's it's gonna it's gonna load. It's gonna be putting reviews into your website every couple of days, and that's what you want because you want some content. This content's already pre-written. Now it does have. You do need a ClickBank account, so go to ClickBank, sign up, and you need your username, and you put that in the software in, in the back office, and this just adds adds uh, stuff content to your blog. Now what I recommend is that I would categorize all of the these that are coming in under reviews, right? So you can have your blog about anything, but then you want to make sure that that you're actually you you want to put everything that there this this software is going to load on there under reviews, right? That's what you want it to be. You want it to be under reviews. So if you want to make money with your blog right in 2020, you want to you want to start building this. And and you're going, "Well, what about du duplicate content and all that stuff?" Guys, it's really easy. You're going to go in and you're just going to you're going to take the paragraphs and you're going to rewrite them, right? Or you could actually go hire someone. I uh, just did a review on some write some content providers and one of them is oh, what is it? Shoot. Um uh i article or i writer or something like that. I can't remember. I'll I'll find it. I'll put it, I'll put a link to it. Um you can buy you can buy an article for like ten bucks or a review or or ten twenty bucks whatever and you can get them to rewrite it say here's here's an article I want you to rewrite this for I want you to rewrite this in an original format and they will rewrite it uh, un unplagiarize it or anything so then you have unique content now you're going well why do I want to have all these reviews on there well because we w we want to start cre creating traffic and people are going to be looking for for reviews on these products because a lot of people go to ClickBank. They see a product, they go, oh, they type in, they want to review it. Now you go, yeah, but I'm not selling ClickBank stuff. I'm going to be doing a travel site. That's okay because this is just a products review thing. Now you could either have a whole section on your blog called travel. If your if your blog is you know Glenn Murray's blog, you could have a whole section on travel, or you create a second blog because you have the server now that is your travel blog. But you can point from this first blog that you're getting already getting automated content put into, right? You can point to your travel blog because this this thing, like I said, it's your garden. You're going to start growing it and growing it and nurturing it. And you want it to grow and you want to keep adding articles to it. And be prepared to spend like, add a, add a new article, like, like $10 a week and add an article to it. Add an article to it. Add an article to it. And just keep adding articles to it. Because why you want to do that is you want that domain to grow. You want that domain to be to be known. And if you can't, if you if you still don't know what you're you want to do your business about, do your business about inf information. Like, hey, how to build a blog, right? And just document your journey on building a blog. I went and put this tool in. I went and did this tool. Find ways of monetizing it. Again, if you're doing a travel blog, then then use this blog as a pointer because what you want to do is every time you write an article on your uh, your one blog. You want another blog that's pointed to it, so you want to point over to your other blog and say, "Hey, go check out this this link." Right? Boom. Go check check out this link. Go check check out, and you want to keep doing that, especially if you are getting traffic coming to this blog because people are searching for your your thing. Makes sense. So that's basically, and I can show you exactly what it looks like, guys. So, um, and I'm going to show you the tip to, that you can make more money with it. So we go back to the screen here this is this is mine this is look at Glen Murray awesome product reviews right this is this is just one of my blogs and this is my review blog and what I do is I link back to my other sites with this blog so I have a bunch of blogs in here but here's the trick guys and I'm gonna put a link to to an autoresponder and I'm gonna put a link to a funnel thing so if you if you click on this review and this is a Clickbank product I can make five hundred dollars every time I sell one of these right when people go to um, to check out the review, watch, they don't go straight to the affiliate link. They go to a landing page. And this is how you double your money, guys. This is how you make way more money. See, I'm going to get their email here, right? It didn't go just straight to John's thing. I'm going to collect their email here, right? I'm going to register, and now it's going to take them... <clears throat> to the affiliate link. Do you get that? That is the secret sauce. That is what you need to be doing. This is how the guys make money. So that person to get to that affiliate link is going and you're going to go, well, maybe they don't want to put their email in. Then they're probably they probably really weren't going to put their credit card in. Right? That's reality. If they weren't willing to put their their email into your your page to get to the next step, they weren't going to be putting their credit card in. So you just actually 
you've just filtered out someone that probably wouldn't buy. You know, you're like, oh, Glenn, I, you know what? I don't put emails in, but I buy. Well, you're probably one of the few because most people need to be taken through a series of steps where they're actually making, they're called like, like they, they do little micro commitments, right? They're micro committing, they're reading the article. They micro commit to click to learn more. They micro commit to give you their email. They micro commit to watch the, sign up for and watch the webinar. Now they've micro committed to all, to all these things. It's much easier for them like, yeah, this is this has been a journey that I want to continue. They want to they want to keep going. What's behind the door? What's behind the door? What's behind the door? That's how you sell way more products, guys. Instead of just sending them to your affiliate. Now, a lot of affiliates do this. They go get a ClickBank account, they go onto Facebook, and they put the link. It's a waste of time. It's a friggin' waste of time. Stop wasting your time. Stop doing stupid stuff. Build a business, take the time, build a business, build a brand, build yourself, right? Do this, create a blog, start building that blog, adding content to it. And if it's duplicate content, okay, when you have some money, go get, go get an article rewritten, right? You know, yes, it's, people say, oh, Google penalizes you when you have duplicate content. It's not like a penalize, they just, they're not going to rank you as high if there's another article the same that has been out there before you. So you need to change your article so that it's original. And if you can't write it and make it original enough, go check. There's lots of plagiarized sites, right? We keep rewriting it until you check it and it goes, yep, that's good. It's, it's an original uh, article. Or just go pay someone 10 bucks to rewrite it for you and make it original or, or $15 or $20 or whatever you can afford and get them to rewrite it to you. And now go to Facebook and talk about it. Go, hey guys, have you heard of this John Crestani guy? Man, is he is he for real or not? You check it out. Or, um, you know, hey, there's this guy that does a two-hour free webinar. explains exactly how to make money online. The guy makes $10,000 $10, a month. Do you want to check out what he's, what he's doing? Right? So this is what you do. And, and, again, you can use this to point to anything. You can point it back to any blog that you're doing, right? So... This is how it's done, and you want to make more and more of this. I talked about it on Facebook, and I said I was going to do this video. You, you're be, build, building a big spider web. The hub is one of your blogs, or and maybe you've got a couple of blogs around that hub. That hub is where you get the email. That, that hub is where you, 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 you ask them to, to buy whatever you're offering. You make them an offer, or, or yeah, you make them an offer that they can't refuse, hopefully. How do you get them there? Well, each little page is like a is is a string of the spider web and it's just drawing them in, drawing them in, drawing them in. You want this spider web as big as you can get it. How do you do that? You keep adding content. Add another ring around, add another ring around, add another ring around. And it's just pages. It's just posts from blogs, right? Have five blogs all in all referring back to each other, right? And but but you've got to be adding content. This is the thing. It's like a garden. You got to keep adding content to it. If you just put up a blog and just leave it stagnant, it that's what it's going to be stagnant. No one's going to find it. Every time Google crawls, it's going to be like, yep, same content, same content, same content. Right? If people are searching, unless you write about the most obscure thing in the world, and and you know there's a thousand people that are looking for that one thing, and you you're you're the only website that has that thing on it. That's a needle in the haystack. All right, guys, have a great weekend. I will see you tomorrow, and hopefully this helps. And again, now, oh, I was going to give you the, the, the thing. Okay, besides, this is a double-double bonus. Besides that email thing, right, how I told you to do it, how I, how I showed you, right, I'm going to put down my business that's going to teach you 10 times that, and you want to do this thing called the business challenge in there. It's amazing. And it's going to show you a ton more tricks and tips. This is where I've learned most of my stuff on how I'm making money daily online. And you you want to do that as well. So you want to click the link below. I'll put it as uh, Glenn's Secret Sauce. I'll put that below and you want to do that. All right, guys. Have a great day. Cheers. Bye.